Hey veggies, how y'all doing? So I am not my typical typical self today. Because I don't feel well. I have a, a head cold, which is combined like with a sinus infection. So if I look a little drained, I'm drained. I have like zero energy. Um, also, we had a tornado touchdown here. So I'm really surprised because we have power now. If you guys can see, the stove is saying that it's 221, but that ain't true. I just came home just now. It's 930 right now. It is not, it's 928, says my laptop. I had my laptop, everything with me at the library to charge my stuff before I got home because we didn't have any power. Didn't have any power. So today is Wednesday, August the 7th. Yesterday the power went off, but I wasn't here. My neighbor today said the power went off yesterday like at 2.30. I had to be at work at 3 o'clock. So I know when I came home yesterday, it was dark. Like I came home like late, early in the morning. So it was pitch dark, but um, I'm just so grateful. I went for a walk today earlier and just to see the aftermath, y'all, it was really, really, really terrible. It was nothing you could say to your neighbors like, you know, be well, blessings. It was just... It was one thing I did like is that people were coming together to help. Um, somebody's generator is still going right now, even though we have power. But uh, I managed. I, I can honestly say I do know I'm going to invest in a little mini uh, Mr. I think it's called. A, it's not a Mr. Buddy, but it's some type of portable machine that you can use to put your cell phone. You know, it has outlets where you can charge your phone and stuff like that, even if you have to plug up your fridge. And I'm so grateful that I don't keep a lot of food in my refrigerator. I'm so grateful because all that stuff would have not been any good. So I did go to the grocery store. Now I can tell, like my eyes, let me see if I can see. The eyes, you can see where it's, oh, it's still melty. Some of it is froze. So I don't know how long it's been on. They actually told, uh, well, my neighbor said, today that it probably wouldn't be going until Friday. So I'm so grateful that it's on now because I went to the grocery store, I'm gonna share that with y'all because when times come like this, you should be prepared, okay? When your when your refrigerator go out, that's why I'm so glad too that I am vegan and I'm just, I'm just keeping it real because I would have no way to cook no food. I just need to make sure I got fruits and vegetables. You can always make you a salad. You can always stock up on fruits and vegetables. You can make juice. I got like a little presser thing. That's why I didn't buy orange juice today. So we're not gonna have no long video, y'all. It's not gonna be no long vlog, but I do wanna share with you guys the things that I picked up from my local grocery store. And I spent um, $25 and, I mean, $18.25 is what I spent. So, if you guys want to see, so I was saying like, from far as my, uh, far as my, um, oh my gosh, like my head, y'all, it hurts. It's like all up in here, the sinus, and you probably can hear it. But I was saying I didn't buy orange juice because I have a presser where I could put the, a real orange on there and do it like that. And then I bought apples. So we'll you sorry, you you guys will see. So let's get over to what she picked up. All right, guys, I got three bags of groceries. And I was supposed to uh, bring you guys something on this channel, but it didn't arrive today at all for me to put it in this vlog. So once it arrives, I'll probably uh, do the sponsor with you guys. So bear with me, okay? So I picked up cherries because they don't have to be refrigerated, okay? So I picked up, a, look how many I got, just a half a little bag. It was like $3 and some change. Picked up those. Two. Uh, Fuji apple is good for a cold. Two bananas. I picked up one head, one thing of garlic, a garlic clove. Because I said, even if the power were normal when I got home, I was going to snack on the cherries and I can make me a salad because I do have a, a couple of those wraps. I was going to make me a wrap or make me a salad. I got one Roma tomato. I bought, even though I got the apples, I still picked up a, a thing of the Meyer. Um, Meyer Brothers uh, Fine Beverages. This is fresh pressed apple juice, never from Concentrate. So this was a really good buy, especially I don't feel well either. So got that. And then I bought some more. Uh, Y'all seen me buy this before. This is the Living Lettuce. It didn't come up for some reason. My Living Lettuce did not come up for the harvest. 
It didn't, y'all. It's some other wild stuff in there that I think I showed y'all before, but it didn't come up, but got this. And you, I, can, I could have washed this off because I still have running water. So I could have washed these, kept it in this container or put it in one of my other containers and just set it on top of the counter and it would have been okay if it wasn't no power. Because I only went to the store based on what it wasn't no power, okay? And I got two navel oranges for me to use the press thing to have juice instead of buying a container of uh, apple juice, okay? And for a snack, I got me some healthy, uh, dark covered chocolate cashews. And it's 50%. I wish it was like more percentage of the cocoa. I wish it was more like 65 on up uh, far as the uh, chocolate, dark chocolate content, I mean, aspect. So guys, I am going to freeze up, throw these bags in the recycle bin and rinse off my cherries and apples. I gotta wash like the cherries, the apples, and the um, this, and then I gotta wash off my uh, lettuce. So guys, I just wanted to show you, be prepared in case you have a tornado coming. Make sure you're always stock, stocked up on water, not bottled water because everybody knows it's gonna clear out. That was one of the reasons why I invested in the Berkey uh, water filtration when they were giving people that free money. That was important to me because the water was flying off the shelves. And then also make sure you have fresh fruits and vegetables. You can make a sandwich, a salad, and most of that stuff can last for a couple of days. You just gotta eat the same thing over and over, but still, at least it won't be that bad. So guys, we are seven minutes in, and I wanna thank you all, like I said, for reaching out to me, telling me to get well. It's gonna take me a couple of days, but I'm here and I'm doing all right. And I just want you to know to always remember to eat and drink yourself well to better health right here, okay? I'll see you in the next one. Bye, y'all. Real talk, guys, this is my fridge before I put those items in there. This morning I did drink uh, the last of that Starbucks coffee that was here and that creamer. And then I was gonna throw this out, but I think it's, it's good. And then um, there are some black beans in here with mushrooms. I could have put that on a salad, but there's my wraps. Those are products. I got a bunch of celery in here. I got a, one carrot down there. Here's my condiments over here. And then in the uh, fridge, earlier I made, you know, when I left out, I had strawberries. It was, a, I used half of this bag and I mixed it with pineapple because like I said, if you can see, it was, uh, now it's getting froze now, but it wasn't froze then. And then I got blueberries. Um, the only thing I was worried about was these that I bought recently that were going to be messed up, but I think they're going to be fine, y'all. Then I had some spring rolls. What is this? I think, oh, this is uh, broccoli. I got a bag of peas, some uh, Brussels sprouts, and another bag of peas. And then in here, I think these are, uh, is these sweet potato fries? Oh yeah, some sweet potato fries. So I think this stuff should be okay because like I said, I didn't ever, I didn't ever like open up the refrigerator. Basically I left for work the other day, which was yesterday. I didn't come back until earlier this morning and I only opened up the refrigerator for one that, you know, to make the, uh, to make the fruit little basket to take with me. All right guys, I gotta go. Had to come back and show you guys dinner. This is my has onions, vegan cheese, lots of carrots, some pickles, the boss, the uh, living lettuce, and purple onion. It's garlic wrapped up in there, and black sesame seeds. And I got some cherries, and I got some of that uh, famous um, apple juice here. Y'all want to hear something? <laughs> the guy who was ringing me out. That's why I love talking to people. It makes it. Sometimes you can give people something to think about. He asked me. He said, uh, "So what are you going to do tonight?" When it's when it get dark or whatever, because like I said, um, I was on my way home from there, so it was gonna get start getting dark, like nine something, 
And I just told him, he said, what are you going to do in the dark? I said nothing. By the time I finished eating my food, I probably just sit around and just uh, think, talk to myself, <laughs> or just be at peace. And he thought that was hilarious. He was like, well, you know what? That's a good thing if you can be by yourself and have peace. And I, I can do that. Yep. So see you guys.